I've done a five minute set before. Right. I've done seven minute sets. Uh, so what I've basically done is I've taken that and I've got 25% of each joke. So, fortunately, we've got more punchlines, but at least we'll get through it in time, you know. It's all, it's all good. Uh, I heard someone the other day say that masturbation was perfectly natural. That person has obviously never heard my message. <laughs> I won't go into the gory details, but let's just say I've got a Henry Hoover at home with a big smile on his face. <laughs> As you might have guessed, I am single. I don't know why this is. It could be many reasons. It can't just be because I'm short, fat and ugly. Although there's not a day goes by when I don't thank the creator for giving me three such character building attributes. Now, it could be for many reasons. It could be because, uh, it, well, I know it's not because my feet smell. In fact, my feet are minty fresh. I put it down to my tic tac toes. <laughs> Could be because I've got some unusual hobbies. You see, I, I like to refine cocaine. Don't get me wrong, I don't do it for money, I'm just in it for the crack. <laughs> uh, it could be because I'm a, I am a bit picky with my women, which go, just goes to show that beggars can be choosers. Uh, you see, uh, I, I, I like my older women, and what's known in the dating community as a widow licker. I, like, I also, I like a face that tells a story, which is why instead of a girlfriend, I've got a Teddy Ruxby. <laughs> Believe it or not, I have had a long-term relationship, uh, but that was doomed right from the start, really. I should have known that when uh, her first words to me were, Excuse me! Are you gay? It's surprising we were together so long when you consider my response was, Yes, yes I am. That ended in the end, I mean, we, we, we argued all the time, we, we were never meant to be together, I mean, you know, I was 21, she was 30, I was an Aquarius, she was a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, like I said, we used to argue all the time, one of the things we used to argue about, she didn't like me peeing in the shower, it, you know, nothing wrong with it, but she thought it was disgusting. In fact, by the end she said, uh, Look, it's, it's disgusting. She got really angry, she said. Look, if you've got to do that, at least wait till I've got out first. <laughs> Needless to say, we're not together anymore. In fact, I'm, I'm, she kicked me out. I'm back living with my mother, which isn't very pleasant. Uh, it doesn't help with a single thing either, to tell you the truth. Uh, only the other day I came back and I was distraught. My mum could see there was something wrong. She said, uh, I said, Mum, oh, do you think it's creepy that I'm 26 years old and I still live at home with you? She said, no, don't be silly. Of course it's not creepy. Now you go to sleep and don't steal all the doobie. <laughs> anyway, uh, I wasn't going to do this, but I think I'm going to finish our song. <laughs> Just because you've, you've, you've been very nice and I'm feeling a bit dead right now. So, uh, Anyway, the, the, this song, it's, it's about a one night stand that you regret in the morning. And I must admit, I've been the regretted more than I've been the regretted. But this is one of the few occasions that I was on the other It's to the tune for all you rock and roll fans of uh, Too Many Broken Hearts by Jason Donnelly. Last night I saw you sleeping in your Think about you were eating Cause most of it's still stuck to your face Just give me that ten pounds that you owe me I'll give you ten more minutes to leave And if you've got the bottle to call me Then I'll tell the police that you're stalking me Too many ugly tots in the world <laughs> Thank you very much.